Now to the investigation into President Biden and the classified documents found in his possession. The White House today being grilled repeatedly about transparency, but declining to provide any new details. What I can say is what the president has said before, what I have said multiple times, we take this very seriously. Anything else specific to uh, when the president knew or anything that's related to this, I would refer you to the White House counsel's office. We're not avoiding anything here. And you've heard, you've heard, you've heard from the president at least twice, and you, we have put forth multiple uh, statements from the White House counsel's office. And so I would uh, continue to refer you to, uh, to my colleague at the White House counsel's office. And this comes as House Republicans are launching their own investigation. Correspondent Tom Dempsey is live in D.C. And Tom, you have an exclusive interview with the new Republican chairman who will lead this probe. Yeah, that's right, Nicole. Good evening. Uh, this evening, the chairman of this uh, committee that's planning to investigate President Joe Biden says subpoenas could be issued in the next several weeks as this committee plans to answer a number of key questions connected to this document controversy. I couldn't agree with you more. Instead of attention being on a meeting with the Japanese Prime Minister at the White House on Friday, President Joe Biden continued to face controversy over classified documents from his time as Vice President being found at his home in Delaware and at his former office in D.C. We don't know what type of documents there are. Uh, who had access to the documents. News Nation spoke exclusively with Representative James Comer, a Republican from Kentucky and the head of the House Committee on Oversight and Accountability, about his plans to investigate the case against the president, including why the disclosure of the documents came weeks after his lawyers first discovered them. This is a national security concern. The fact that they uh, had classified documents improperly stored and in, in their possession uh, only adds to the to the urgency of our investigation. Comer noted the similarities to the investigation against former President Donald Trump and his handling of classified documents, but said more attention deserved to be on this latest case. Why investigate President Biden, but not necessarily investigate former President Donald Trump when you're saying that, you know, some of the cases were somewhat similar? There are plenty of people investigating Donald Trump, including this new special prosecutor. We want to know why uh, we didn't learn about the, the fact that Joe Biden had these classified documents earlier. The classified documents case comes as House Republicans, with their new majority, plan to open a number of investigations against the Biden administration, including the family's overseas business dealings and Hunter Biden's time with the Ukrainian gas company. We're following the money, and I think the American people are going to be outraged when they realize how much anonymous money has flowed from China directly into the Biden's back pockets. The American people deserve answers, and we will do everything in our ability to get those answers. News Nation reached out to the White House about those claims from Comer and the Biden family in China, but this evening we still await a response. But Comer added that other investigations could include looking into the pandemic relief funding and more accountability over that, as well as border security and decisions made by Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas. Nicole? All right, so, so Tom, important to note there you're saying investigations, plural there. What sort of evidence does the committee have in, in any of the cases? Yeah, a number of investigations to follow right now, and specifically the one regarding the Biden family's uh, overseas business dealings. Uh, Comer is saying that a laptop belonging to Hunter Biden could play a very key role in that investigation because it could contain some information and uh, contents that could be crucial to answering some of the questions about who they conducted business with and what exactly happened when Hunter Biden served with a and worked with a Ukrainian gas company. All Nicole? right. Tom, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.